What's going on guys, it's your boy Darth Eternal here with a Star Wars update. Yes, we are on a roll guys, we are keeping it going and it is a good week for Star Wars fans because we have Book of Boba coming out this week, which is amazing, but before we do get into that, we have some big news today without further ado, but before we do start, hit that subscribe, like and notification bell so you're always in the know. Also, go check out my last two videos as they were a good one and you don't want to miss out guys. So also subscribe to the channel as you are watching because it helps with the algorithm and it helps grow our channel. So let's start the show. So it is apparent that O. Jackson Jr. offers high praise for his mysterious role. Now, if evidently we know that this role of his is going to be the highlight of his career i mean talking to pop culture you know he stated that he was grateful for his role in the disney plus show but that he couldn't divulge details on the highly anticipated project he joked that the mickey mouse was calling him making sure he didn't say too much about the secretive series and here's what he had to say this is the best job i've ever had in my life i can't go into too much details have to wait for that green light to come so that's pretty cool and he also added that the project was a dream like he said come true and this was there was more that he had to say it was such an honor to work with star wars or shall i say for star wars i'm such a nerd and if anybody who really knows me knows i'm a nerd to the core which is awesome right we're all nerds that's why we love star wars right and that was the best job I ever had in real life, or in my life, shall I say. I just want to go back and I hope there are reshoots. Now, do I think that there were reshoots? Possibly. Maybe. I don't think so, but who really knows? And there was one more thing that he did have to say. I can't wait for people to see it. I can't wait to see this trailer. I'm over here drooling like everybody else. And as I'm speaking, I'm drooling because I cannot wait for the kenobi series i can't wait for a trailer to drop now i do believe that when we get this trailer it's not gonna be much it's gonna be like little things we'll probably get like two or three trailers maybe two i would say, i would honestly leave it at, at like two i think three is pushing and not the way we've gone with book of boba i think book of boba we got very very lucky we got very you know blessed to have all these trailers but kenobi doubt it we're not gonna get that and that's okay because honestly i'd rather leave the hype for when the series is here and it comes and we can watch it and talk about it as we always do with every show that has come out so far starting from the bad batch to the book of boba to mandalorian and more so guys let me know what you think about this news how you feel about you know o'shea jackson jr really you know touching on this and giving you know his his thoughts on it and his praises on it because again we do know that you know it's been nine years before the events of a new hope you know this is 10 years after revenge of the sith so we cannot wait to see the biggest fight of the century come back you know between vader and kenobi it's going to be a good one so stay tuned for that thank you so much for tuning in guys remember hit that subscribe like and notification bell so you're always in the know guys later <laughs> 